So practically I'm in the middle of working on my computer and doing what I've been asked to do by the politician that supports and helps me with a very modest and minuscule stipend. And while I'm working on it, a woman walks up and says, excuse me, sir. And I can tell she's elderly by her voice and her softness of voice, but what I can see is the stillness of Satan in her eyes. I ask her to wait for just a minute so I can finish the thought I was working on and get it completed so that the computer could process while I'm listening to her. As a gentleman, I stand up to receive her, but she's trying to provide me $2. And basically, she tells me she has no car, she's come into the community with her, her daughter, and I insist that I can't take her money, that she's a hardworking person, that she, certainly she needs the money a little more than me, and I encourage her to go back into the Dollar Tree to try some of their pot stickers. And openly, she said thank you very much, and she went back in the store. I can't tell you how I feel about this because I don't want to be played with. And the $2, I'm going to play with you $2 game has been over with by, gosh, at least three to four weeks, if not a good on two months. Please don't come up and play at me if you're not really sincerely trying to test yourself against the Lord. Because if God says no, it means God is saying no to you, not me saying no to you. I am one of those people that is led by faith, led by my angels, led by me. And you're not going to keep playing with me as if you're going to do this. Another vehicle is now driving past me, and the late is AC8. Six nine, and I missed the last two, but that's a partial. So the people listening to me and looking for that information can take that in. Thanks so much for playing, because my life is supposed to be your game.